Thank you once again. Um, chart number 15. I'm uh, going to speak on the profession only and the profession in the stock market. Uh, first, we need to understand the stock market. Chart number 15. Page number. In novel circle. So the stock market, uh, we need to understand as a profession and as an investment. So what I'm going to say here as a profession, not as an investment, because in, for investment, what we do from our earning, we make investment, either FDR, post office, gold, silver, so many things, commodities. But here, what I'm going to speak is the profession is share market. If we see in the past, the share market was not there when Rishi Prashra has written, and all this has come due to industrialization and globalization, Ma mainly from the 18th century, when some industrialization has happened and the companies have started coming in India and shares being a part of the ownership in some company. It is, it is like that. Okay. So, but then we need to understand when, uh, if I want to make my career in, in uh, share market, what Rishi Prashra has given us, whether they've given us some guidelines because it was not there at that time. What I need to see as a, as a somebody comes to me and asks, I want to build my career in profession as a share market, what I need to guide him, what I need to uh, tell him, what, what you need to do. So what principle I have informed earlier, for any profession, definitely we need to see the 10th house, 10th uh, lot, and 11th house, 11th lot, second house, second lot. But for profession, as a in share market, we need to see only main focus on the second house and second lot. And we need to clearly understand the Dhan Yoga whether it is a formation of Dhan Yoga in his chart. But Dhan Yoga should be different from the Dhan. We should not treat Dhan as a Dhan Yoga. There are certain classical principles. I, I'll go through uh, uh, early in this, where Rashraji has given certain directions which will help you a native, whether to go in that career or no. What they have informed in Bharat Prasha Hora Shastra, when the Lord of the House of Wealth, what is the House of Wealth? There's the second house. So, if the house of wealth, the second house, if it is there, and if the house of uh, second house or placed, Lord is placed in angle or trines, the two trines and the angles, if they are placed, it is should treated as a promoter of wealth. This is for journal also. He has given journal direction, not for share market. But for share market, we need to see the Lord of second house should be in Kendras or Trikonas. Second house, if it is in a benefic sign, or it is benefic is placed in the second house, it is an increase of wealth for the native. Other is that second house, why it is important? Because it is a storage of wealth. Our all wealth is stored in this house. Then the lord of the house of wealth being placed in the benefic, you have 11th house and this. If there is any combination of the second, with the 11th and 11th with the second, it promotes our wealth. So that is a good sign for any prof profession. When the Lord of the house of wealth is placed in angle and their Lord of the house of the prophet is placed in trine or Jupiter is together with the Venus in respect of gains in wealth as a means a measure will be understood. These are the benefits, but what are the negatives? There will be some negatives also. So what is the negative they inform? Second Lord or 11th Lord. Second Lord or 11th Lord and placement of Mars in the 11th house makes a native poor. Okay. Then if the Lord of the house of wealth and profit are placed in 6, 8 and 12, Profit placed in 6 and 12 and Mars is placed in the house of profit and Rahu in the house of wealth, there will be loss of wealth due to royal punishment. The person who will earn money, he will go to jail. That is the broader meaning of Rishi Prashra. Then second Lord, if in the Kendra or Trikona, native takes care of his family. 
So sometimes we see family dispute when a person is not taking care of family. Rishi Prashara has given us direction that if second lord, second lord is in Kendra or Trikona, the native will take care of family. And if it is not there, then he did not. Similarly, malefic in Artrigona, then there are issues in generation of wealth. Okay. And then the last native should not put money in stock market when he should not. Anybody of you who are putting their money in stock market, they must understand when we should not put the money and when we should put the money. So Rishi Parashara has given us a direction that when your wealth will increase and when your wealth will not increase. So when you did not do this, he informed that when fifth lord and eleventh lord Dasha is running, or second lord or eighth lord Chip is running Dasha, then please do not put your money in the risky ventures. That is the direction given by Rishi Parashara. Let us go in this chart and look it and look into it. Uh, Rao sir has informed in his book Finite Technique of Astrology Prediction that what is Mars? We'll say Mars is a very, very bad planet. But Rishi uh, uh, Rao sir has informed that Mars is a planet of valor. Strong Mars is favorable for success through self-efforts. Okay, Mars is good for self-efforts and a good third lord and a good Mars are necessary for success from braving life storms. If there's any ups and downs will come, if you have a strong Mars, it will you sail you through properly from your life journey. So he has given. And in Narada Purana, it is mentioned that when Mars is placed in the 11th house, which is in this case, Mars is in the 11th house. When Mars is in the 11th house, it makes the native rich and self-respected. Okay. Then what we need to see, the native 10th house, if you see, what we inform, I informed in my earlier uh, uh, presentation also, that native 10th house un, unafflicted. When a person's 10th house is unafflicted, no major affliction is there, there is a growth in the profession of a person. So here it is unafflicted. And the 10th Lord and 5th Lord is the Yogkaraka Mars is placed in 11th house. 11th house is our desire to excel in life, to do something, make achievements. So here, here it is a Yogkaraka planet, 5th Lord, 10th Lord in the 11th house. And what they are doing? They are making a Chandramangal Yoga. Okay. So what is moon? Mars is energy and moon is the fast moving planet. Fastest moving planet we all know. So if there's a Mars is energy and moon is a power of planet of mind, the combination of both Mars and moon a forming a yoga particularly makes a native enterprising, intelligent, hardworking, wealthy and successful in life. Then Mars Moon making a strong Raj Yoga also here and both Chandra Mangal Yoga also in the 11th house. As per Man Sagari, if the moon is placed in 11th house, where in this case moon is placed in the 11th house, then the native earn money through various means also. His source of income will not be one. He will put his money in various ventures and try to earn through that money also. Now, if we we'll see in this chart, where is my second lord? Second lord son, if we we'll see second lord son is placed in the third house. And 11th and 4th lord Venus is also placed here. Making a strong Dhan Yoga also in the third house. It means third house is our self-efforts, karmas, action, where I start, where Dhan Yoga is made. So third lord, exalted Mercury, placed in third house with Venus and Sun, Saturn as seventh and eighth house. Saturn is aspecting all these planets, is the eighth house. Eighth house, already explained by our uh, colleague, our uh, uh, research uh, students, that 8,000 sudden gains and sudden losses also. So it is looked into. And what we got in our various charts in our class, and if there is a combination of second house, third house, and PS is made with the eighth lot from the sixth house, the person earns money through brokerage, commission. This is the new dimensions 
we find it is not available in any classic. We find in our research while looking into various horoscope that anybody who is doing insurance business, anyone who is doing brokerage business, anyone who is earning through commissions, there is a combination of sixth, second and third should be there. Then only he can earn through commissions. Now third house, a pivot of karma, calm trikona, the angle of action, second lot sun, which is the source of life and creativity of universe. Sun is a life and creativity of universe with fire element, given a lot of energy to the native. And third house falls eighth house from the eighth. Third house is also eighth from it, which I explained earlier also. Hence poses signification of eighth house also, which is suddenness, which are suddenness and unexpectedness. Things will come. Therefore, the third house and the third lot imbib the element of surprise and unexpectedly, which are associated with the eighth house. It is also observed that PSE connection of second house, a house of wealth creation, third house, a house of efforts, and sixth house, a house of services, give a earning through brokerage and commission. Now, if we see uh, to the uh, uh, other, other element, fifth house, aspected by exalted. Jupiter, Jupiter, if you see in this chart, three planets are exalted. Look into it. Which are the moon is exalted, Jupiter is exalted, and Mercury is exalted. Three planets are exalted. And no affliction, no major, small affliction is there from Mars to second house. No affliction to the major affliction to any of the house. Small affliction, what we found in our research, particularly in uh, share market, if anybody is doing, some affliction is required to bear the losses. This is very important. You cannot have all in share market, you cannot get gains. You must have losses also. But most of the people leaves at the time of losses. When the market will go down, the, it will not behave properly. We'll just withdraw our money and leave the. So, but if you want to take a risk, your second house should be afflicted. Small affliction should be there to take a risk. That element is there. This is from the Lagna. You see from the moon chart also. If we make moon as a Lagna, you see the second lord will be exalted Mercury placed in the fifth house from moon. And then moon to 11th lord, again exalted Jupiter placed in the third house, aspecting 11th house. And moon to 10th house, Saturn placed in the 8th house, aspecting second house and fifth house. Same, same combination is coming from the moon moon chart also. The astrological combination both from Lagna as well as moon reflect that native can have earning through speculative mode with ups and downs in his life. Now this uh, native is a young boy, not a very old uh, chap, very young boy. He starts, he did his uh, graduation and after that he, he did some uh, uh, certificate course in share market, work with the share market uh, broker for a few years and then he started his own, own uh, business. Native got his first job in Rahu, Moon Dasha in, in 2015. Exalted Moon placed in 11,000 and Jokarka Mars in D1 and Moon well placed in own 7,000 D9. Indicate the gain to Native and startup earning. We have seen uh, in profession career also, when a person will start earn. And we found that a person will start earning and his first salary will come in the 11th lot or 11th house uh, or second house, second lot. Combination should be there either in uh, Mahadasha, Antardasha, or Padantardasha. Normally, PD will prevail over these two. But any of this should be there. Then only you will get his first earning. Otherwise, first earning will not come. Okay. So in the Rahu Mahas Dasha, Chitra Dasha, if you see the Chitra Dasha was there, he start losing some money. He did his own business and uh, doing his own business is not easy, particularly share market. But he stick to his profession and ultimately he succeeded. He faced a challenge in Mars Rahu last Chitra Dasha in profession in mutual funds and share market. Mars Yogkarga placed in 11th again indicate gain to native. Though the Chitra Dasha he fear face various challenges, but strong Raj Yoga in the 11th house, what we see in the Chandra Mangal Yoga and the uh, Dhan Yoga also, pushed him in his objectives and he improved consistently 
in his earnings. And when the exalted Jupiter Dasha started, that it was totally changed. The Jupiter Dasha, which was started as exalted Jupiter, he established himself. And at a young age now, he is from share market is earning around 2 lakh rupees per month in his own profession. So hence, and similarly, if you see, I, I will not elaborate more. If you see in the D9 and D10 also, hence from the discharge, you can observe that strong 10th house, 10th lot, 11th house, 11th lot, and second house, second lot, which are forming yogas. Yoga is very, very important in any profession. If they are forming yoga, give a very stable, consistent, and smooth earning to the name. Thank you very much. Loss to a way, share market the profit over in the market to profession. Yes, sir. Go to the Nevada, Hamburg, Napisco, Ekoji, Pesemilake, after both the Nepal or Sayok Karniki. Go to the Nepal. Go to the Nepal. Twenty nine with the last, last Saturday. Next week, exam rega to twenty nine coming. 